Grain is a grain. That's what's happening. It's you got a black abstract. You liked it once again. I appreciate you for it. Do me a favor. Make sure you like, subscribe. We got breaking news that just came in. Uh, this is from the AP, Associated Press. Apparently, there's been an arrest in the murder of rapper Takeoff from the Migos. Uh, as we know, he passed away. Um, unfortunately and prematurely uh, earlier uh, or last month. Um, sad news uh, took everybody by shock, especially by everybody in the culture. Just real ride. Everybody were in shock because of this. Uh, but they finally got a suspect in custody. So according to the AP and all outlets, it's this man right here. We posted. it. Uh, it's a 33-year-old man uh, who his name is Patrick Xavier Clark. I remember last year they were saying, or not last year, but... Uh, a month ago, you know, all the internet detectives were saying that it was a specific person. I don't think this is the person. Listen, I'm not one of those people. I'm only putting this out because this is like confirmed news. But there was a lot of speculation as to who did it, as little this and little that. And, uh, but this is the man that they have in suspect. Uh, this is what it says. Houston AP. Police have arrested 33-year-old man on a murder charge and a fatal shooting of rapper Takeoff, who they said was an innocent bystander to gunfire last month outside a bowling alley in Houston. Uh, Patrick Xavier Clark was taken into custody peacefully Thursday night. Houston Police Chief Troy Flanner said, Finner said Friday. Clark is the second person arrested in connection with the shooting that wounded two other people. Um, <clears throat> born... Uh, Krishak Kari Ball takeoff was the youngest member of the Migos, the Grammy non the Grammy non nominated rap trio from suburban Atlanta that also featured his uncle Quavo and cousin Offset. Um, the twenty three year the twenty eight year old magician was one of three people police said that were shot outside downtown Bowling Alley around uh, two thirty a.m. on November first when a dispute erupted as about forty people were leaving a private party in an alley. Police have said another man. And woman suffered non-life-threatening gunshot injuries during the shooting, in which at least two people uh, opened fire. Uh, Police Sergeant Michael Burrow said during a during fr during a news conference Friday that the shooting followed a dispute over a game of dice, but that takeoff was not involved and was an innocent bystander. On Wednesday, police announced the arrest of Cameron Joshua in connection to the shooting. The 22-year-old was charged with illegally having a gun at the time takeoff was shot, but Burrow said investigators believe it was Clark's gunfire that killed the rapper. So they got actually two people in custody, but this particular person they have in custody is the gunfire they believe uh, 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 killed takeoff. And I said this in my, my post-release video when takeoff died. Uh, now I said this best. He said... Uh, I had to school him, told him, don't let niggas fool him, because when the pistol blows, the ones that's murdered be the cool one. As we can see, Takeoff wasn't doing nothing in the video. It wasn't in a hostile, hostile environment. It was literally two people shooting at each other, and they're saying that um, this person uh, was actually trying to hit somebody else, and Takeoff just happened to be in a way. And what I didn't know that I just learned is that... Uh, that Two other people got shot. I didn't even know two other people were shot in the but they never do tell us that. They only tell us the big names. Um, and unfortunately, this big name happened to be that of takeoffs. Um, I'm glad that this got these people got arrested. You know, it ain't no more bloodshed in the street. Uh, but I'm sure people obviously some people probably wanted that. But it's sometimes you just got to let due process be due process. I'm glad that. His murder isn't going isn't going unsolved. Obviously, there's still the 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 case where they have to be tried and convicted. But you know, let's let's see what uh judicial system uh, works in his favor. So I guess this man is known as his name is DJ Pat as well. I'm just seeing that. Uh, let's just say rest in peace to take off. Uh, post your comments below. Let me know what you guys think about this. Make sure you like, subscribe. Uh, peace.